Good evening, it's six o'clock and we've got a brand new one day special for you, which means we've got a very, very exciting hour because we've got the lovely Maria Morehouse with us. How are you? Oh, I'm here, I'm happy. Here. Yes, uh, are you well? Are you okay? Um, yeah. Good. Good. We are in for a fabulous show today Lovely because I know product. how talented you are and I love, love working with you for that. And we also like working with Clarity. So yes, we're birds of a feather then, aren't Indeed, we? Indeed, yeah. We certainly Beautiful. are. Um, and that is the theme it of is. your one day special. 12 stamps and four stencils. It's an incredible deal because what you're getting here is the beautiful overlay stamps and the stencils as well included in that deal you're saving 15 pounds and because we've got those stencils on a special deal throughout the shows you're saving your 15 pounds so it's like you're getting your stencils for free after the one day special if you were to go for those stencils they are going back up to 19 pounds and 96 pence so you're making a great saving this is the deal to go for 804756 let's take a look at what you're getting for your two payments on Flexi Buy. These are fabulous, Maria, aren't they? They are. So these were designed by uh, Mel Turner in house. So what we've got is the set of four three lay over stamp, overlay stamps. Um, so in each of these lovely sets, what we have um, numbered is we have the, the line art stamp, which is number one. So this is traditionally the stamp that you would stamp and then colour in with your pens or your pencils. Then number two will actually colour your image for you inside of your image and then when we come on to number three that will colour the background outside of your image so you can use these in in any combination you can use each of the stamps individually or you can use one and two one and three two and three whichever they're very very versatile Wow, what a fabulous combination. Now, I used an overlay stamp in the craft along with Barbara yeah. on Sunday, and it's fascinating the results that you get that look so fantastic. Can we show you some samples? Um, I love the images of birds. They're beautiful. They birds really are. are. Yeah, I, I do like birds. And the thing is, you can use them for so many occasions. They're, yes. they're very, um, you know, they're, they're really fabulous. Um, this is lovely. This is from Dee. So I think Dee's actually used um, the uh, number two stamp, which is kind of the infill but she's used it as actual line art here so the difference is what Dee's got here is just a thicker line art if you like yes. instead of using it as um, the sort of the colouring in element love that you've got the sentiments in there as well try out your, your wings. wings what a yeah. great sentiment mm -hmm. I think it's something we should all do and there I mean look at that that's just in the black and white how effective that's right. is that yeah Barbara Lancaster um, so again uh, what Barbara's done there with the fly where your dreams take you she's used the number three which is the back background stamp um, and then again Barbara's and use number two um, on the it's time to spread your wings and fly so again she's got like this just a lovely thicker um, sort yeah. of outline if you like isn't that beautiful uh, and then this sample right here birds of a feather flock, flock together. together well that's as crafters isn't it it's yeah very much so isn't that lovely so white embossing there as well um, some lovely blue and on the craft card very elegant looking it certainly is now this has taken my breath away yeah, look Linda at Spencer. that so Linda's used, and um, this is actually, um, uh, she's combined with one of our club stamps, yes, our new design yes. club stamps, and then put the lovely uh, clouds in place there as well, um, which I possibly will do some clouds tomorrow at okay. some point. I've got lots of plans, what we'll get oh, through, I don't know. Oh, fantastic, uh, fantastic. Another Andy. sample here as well, this is from um, Andy. Andy. Yeah. Isn't this lovely? I really like this work Again, in the background. Yeah, very, so this is actually um, combining the stencil and the stamp as well. Um, just very clean and simple looking, just, just really, really really nice and then of course we can go to the other extreme with Sam where we go very sort of grungy and mixed media look in here um, so Sam has just used it all there she's got a gel plate going on with her, um, her paints and so forth isn't that fun I love that cool. um, now that's going to make a lovely wall hanging if you place this in a frame for example with a mount mm -hmm. it's something that you're going to look at maybe it's for inspiration before you walk out the door you know try out your wings or birds of a feather um, and it gives you that inspiration to have that on your wall one more sample to show you here with your one day special uh, this has been designed by Carol again using color in this very much so you know it, it's up to you go you know sort of clean and simple or just get all of the bright colors going 
going on this is really really nice um, and again Carol she used the background stamps there so as I say all three of the stamps can be used independently or combined together it's and up to you well that's the value you're getting here with your money because yes you do have your sets of four stamps but mm -hmm. they can be used individually yeah. um, which means then you've got three six nine twelve stamps to work with mm -hmm. individually if you want to but use them as that overlay maybe it's something new to you and you've not done that before so you're gonna have a lot of fun when you get these home you also get the stencils as well uh, you're saving 15 pounds it's like you're getting the stencils included in your deal because we do have that special price on the stencils yes. for the one day special period um, other than that you'll be paying 1996 six for those stencils uh, so we do have them at a great price if you want to buy them separately you can but come on with that payment of 39 pounds and 94 pence you can get all of these home we'll send them all out at the same time then you've got another payment in a month's time it's a great way to spread your wings by splitting the cost into two so this is your one day special 804756 is your item number now of course we've got clarity we've got clarity stamps um, but let's have a look at the groovy plates okay. yeah let's do this um, and these will work hand in hand same imagery that you've got on here but of course with groovy this is uh, something that you absolutely adore don't you Maria? I do indeed yeah well I, I think you know many many thousands of people love groovy yes so um, what we've done is brought the same designs um, from Armel and put them in groovy form as well um, these are really nice size these are our a6 square um, plates uh, which we sometimes we refer to them as baby plates Aww. all right so they're they're really nice they're um, a lovely size and again we've got the same um, imagery here so what you've got in actual fact across the stamps the stencils and the groovy you've got the same designs with different formats and also different sizes as well because each one our stencils are seven inch square um, the stamps are I think they're just under uh, four inches yes, yes. Um, and then we've got the um, the groovy plates as well which are just uh, slightly larger than, than the stamps that is for, look at that sample there and this yeah, one this here as well with the pico cutting um, goes really hand in hand because it looks like little birds have gone around and have pecked all of the words just there I mean I love that I really yeah, really she do she's done a beautiful job on that hasn't she yeah she certainly um, has and then just lots of white here from uh, Glynis a little bit of, of black um, that's just a stunning piece so Glynis has just mixed and matched um, the plates as well here um, and then she's built up a nice frame with the feathers as well just really nice just play with the plates look at that yeah, yes again now, beautiful I picked this up and I was like oh look at that uh -huh. now, have they been cut out and put on or, or no, is it um, the card behind I think what Maggie's done here is she's actually kind of embossed them a little from this is I'm guessing oh, yeah. yes you can see think that. that from the, the feel because I did the same I ran my fingers across yeah. and I think if, if Maggie is actually embossed them from behind to give them that kind of raised look and then she's blacked them out so it's it's really lovely piece that, isn't oh it? my goodness do you know something we are 20% of the stock already gone of the groovy the place groovy yeah right. we really are there's a freedom price on here everyone you're saving four pounds and 70 pence it's 15 pounds and 26 pence if you are a freedom member delivered price to your door look at that yeah another one from Maggie so again just this beautiful you know feathers very soft looking very calm looking um, really nice piece I think you'll see with these samples that I'm showing you as well there's different designs different techniques yes. to make them look different each and every time yeah and if you are making or creating and selling on a craft fair for example these are going to be perfect very much for that. so um, I mean Jane's here uh, the, the one with all the birds on the it's like a committee meeting that isn't it so oh, that was um, like our nice. meeting earlier on <laughs> indeed um, so James just sort of you know combine the beds from different plates and, and put them all together which is really yeah. lovely that is beautiful mm -hmm. nine seven five eight to nine seven is your item number but we're very very busy hopefully we'll get a chance to demonstrate these a little later on but 20% uh, of the stock already gone uh, now we've got some returning favorites uh, the birds have flown back in for you um, and these are lovely you've got your fresh cut dies here for you and you've got three uh, what I love about these as well and Maria as well I, I remember doing a show uh, with Paul and Barbara the snip ability in these so you can cut out elements Very if you want so. to yes so they are paper cut dies so the the um, design actually stays within the card um, until you actually snip it out yeah. but it's very much there as you say you know just take the bits that you want chop them out alter them lay them behind each other I mean here just simply cut uh, white card with black behind and black card you know with with, with white behind very very elegant 
when you look at this you see the tree and then you yes. look again and you see the three birds That's that right. are in that tree yeah. uh, mm -hmm. and I love that and to accentuate that and make them stand proud there yeah. you go you can add some color if you want to uh-huh you can indeed and then this one is exactly the same um, dye as, as with the gold and, and red one but just a completely different look there yeah um, one sort of goldy and then this one's just a little fun color so also you know every sort of age group here as well for birds you know children like birds older yeah. people yeah, like they, they can you know be symbolic of lots of uh, lots of things lots of occasions they certainly can um, this was lovely sometimes the they're acrylic. to give hope and sometimes they are to remember yeah um, so this is a lovely collection to get 34 pounds and 97 pence you're saving 10 pounds and you get your four by four inches that's your trio of birds it's your aperture die collection from fresh cut dies five five two one eight one uh, and then we've got some stencils for you as well uh, and these are fabulous to use and create and to use your paste through and your ink yes. through as well uh, we've got the set of three that you can see there these are your clarity stencils and these are only 9.97 that's for all three saving five pounds it's a fabulous deal yeah that's pretty much uh, maybe like copper short of um, one of those stencils coming to you free um, we've got the same beautiful imagery on here as well only larger format so and as you say uh, your pastes and your gels and your paint your gel plate your inks and brushes um, they the, you know stencils are one of the the most versatile craft tools that we have so to get really beautiful artwork like this is is, is lovely I wonder if you could use these to emboss with as well yes oh that would be lovely mm -hmm. it's a great price because what you're doing in, in a sense you're getting three for the price of two aren't you as you're saving five pounds it's only nine pounds and 97 pence <laughs> 740 749 is your item number if you want to go for those so we've got a lot of variety for you all with that wonderful theme of birds of a feather so if you are a twitcher you're going to love this show you really are uh, right whilst we head to the demonstration area take a look at this Right, we're back here at the demonstration area. As always, this is your show as well. So if anyone has any questions, you can email in at studio at hochanda.com. And of course, if you've got anything you want to show us that you've made with some of the previous collections that we've bought back, we would love to see them. I'm sure Maria Lovely. would love to see them as well. Yeah. Right, what we're going to do? Okay, so first of all, um, it's an idea just to introduce how the stamps um, sort of work because they are three lay um, okay. overlay. So we've got some here actually, um, sort of, yeah, this one. Oh, yes. yeah. So we can just yes, show yes, yes. maybe a little bit closer up without destroying the sat. Yeah. Um, because what we said is here, they are numbered. So down the side, you will see number one, yep. number two, and number three. So um, there you go. So that will kind of guide you as to which sort of order to use them. If you're using all three, but then you know yep. there's certain techniques where you change it around a little yeah. bit, and maybe you might not be using number one. So but those we, we've numbered them as so, so that we can explain. We can say this is number one, this is number two, this is number three. Super, okay? and that's the same on all of the sets. Yes, yeah, all four sets and all of our uh, three-way yes. um, overlays. Okay, so um, so what I'm going to do, I just want to show how using all three okay yep. um just for anybody that's new i know a lot of our viewers are, are, have seen our concept of three-way stamps before but for anyone that's new and just a reminder maybe so um what i've done here i've actually mounted these on on acetates for me to use as as mounts so we've got some okay. mounts on the yes, yeah. um on the website but i'm going to use some some acetates because bigger stamps um and the bigger they are um 
you know it's easier with yes. some, some acetate okay. all right so this is number one so this is a the very very fine line um stamps these ones number one um lovely if you like your coloring in and that sort of thing really cool so i'm going to stamp this one out first of all i'm just going to stamp on copy paper what i did with this when i stamped one out so that i had sort of a finished one i thought it's a shame just to leave it on copy paper so i actually did um make it into um, just a, a little Ooh, um, sample. I thought it's um, oh, could do something quick shall with Shall I show that. you? Shall I show them? Yeah, go on then. <gasps> isn't that lovely? It's, not, it's nice and easy. It's just a little canvas. That is gorgeous. It's, it's glazed as well. Very nice. Okay. Right, I like that. All right, so I'm going to ink this uh, this stamp up then. So I'm going to go with um, a black. Uh, archival okay. um, or we could use a black versafine just a, a nice good black ink pad so let me just make sure that I've got plenty of ink on there okay and then I'm going to stamp I'm going to try and make sure it's the right way around here we go fly where your dreams take you so I'm just going to pop that down and then I'm just going to press all over the stamp now if you've got a stamping platform and you're used yes. to using that can you use these with them yeah at home I have got a, a stamp yes. platform um, but we don't do um, platforms you see we have our, our mounts yeah. say for me this is good I'm still struggling yes. with uh, with shoulder so f this is this is better yeah. for me okay I'm, I'm not at my best so fingers crossed let's see now we I are approaching 20% of the one day special gone already. Remember you get your three overlay stamps, you get four of those, uh, four sets, uh, which are fantastic, all birds of a feather themed. Uh, you get those gorgeous sayings in there as well. And you also get the stencils. So you're getting the stencils. Well, the saving is 15 pounds. That's the price mm -hmm. we've got the stencils at throughout the show. Yeah. It's an incredible deal. And you can buy your one day special and divide the cost on interest free payments of 39 pounds and 94 pence. So just to let you know, 20% of the stock gone approaching 20%. Okay, right. So, um, so we've got number one in oh, place. Yeah. Okay. So um, really nice and fine. So you could just work with that. You might want to just get your pens and pencils out um but well, you could send tangling you, in that abs yeah, you absolutely could yeah um you yes you, you could um i'm going to do sort of a little bit um sort of doodly oh, i you? think t tomorrow possibly oh. i've got so much I'll have to watch that. That I, we're probably not going to get through all of okay. it but i've sit we're certainly not going to run out of things to do okay all right so this one now um number two is probably my favorite um, because it gives me lots of versatility. I can color in the image that I've got or I can use this as thicker line art. Um, and, and I am gonna use that in a little while for, as thicker line art. Okay, so this is just a yellow. So I'm gonna come in cross now, excuse my head just for a minute because it's, it is a good idea to look straight through. And that's the, the beauty stamp. of the clear stamps. Yeah. You can is. position them. Perfectly. Yeah, I, I, I haven't actually, to be honest, because well, when we're at home, you've got all the time in the world, haven't you? Um, yeah. But to be honest, I'm not too too worried because I'm going to treat it as a, a highlight or a shadow. Okay. okay. There we go. So just give that plenty of press all over. Okay. And we've got the finished piece anyway. Oh, there we go. Look but, at that. So that now looks like it's shadowy, doesn't it? In yeah. actual fact. So I'm quite happy with that. That's that's fine. I say the, the finished one is okay. That's yes. the, the main thing. Right, yo. Yeah. Okay, so number three. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to come in with grey. One of my favourite colour ways mm. is uh, yellow and grey. Yeah. But what I didn't want to do was darken this too much. I didn't want to completely um, sort of blot it out. Yeah. Um, if I did want to do that, I would just sort of put the, the ink all over the whole of the stamp. Okay. Um, but what I want to do is kind of just give it a bit of a haze more in the corners. Okay. So I'm going to come in now with a grey uh, ink pad. I do and I'm like just this colour combination. Yeah, it is quite um, quite elegant. It's a bit um, retro as well, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Right, here we go. So again, I'm just going to come in over the top. And then, okay. So they are, you know, relatively easy to, to line up. It's just as I say, when we're on yeah. telly, we get a bit, we've got to do it quick, we've got to do it quick. Aww. So, um, whereas at home, Take I don't. Take time. Yeah. So, good press on there bring that up oh, okay that. so it's pale but what I did on the finished one it was pale it's better to be pale than too dark yes. so then I've come back in and I think on the finished one I did this three because this is a pale gray this is um, this is not the dark gray 
Yeah. So I'm going to go back over again and give it uh, number two. There we go. So again, just line that up over the top and give that a press. And then I will probably give it a third go as well. Let's see what we've got. So you can see it building up the colour, yes, can't you? Yeah. So you could just keep going until you are happy with the level that you've, you, you've got. But as I say, I'm sure on the finished one, I did three layers. So I'll do yeah. three layers. It's interesting, isn't this. it, how you, you're just going around the outside and you can use that part of the stamp yeah. to, to really bring that in. But look at those crisp, clear lines when putting that together. Yeah. I think it's absolutely fantastic because if you were to do the outline of that and then maybe try and colour it in, all the different areas that you've got, like the wings and, mm -hmm. you know, on this particular one, uh, fly where your dreams take you. And it yeah. means that you've got that colour in perfectly. And that's the beauty of these three-way yeah. overlay stamps. Yeah, very much so. So so that is how the uh, the, the stamps work. Um, Perfect. Just, just play with them. And yeah. I say any, any combination. So that's just the most basic. Yes. All right. Yeah. Um, so with that one, then literally I did this on copy of paper. And then all I did there was I took one of my little canvases and yes. I stuck that on and then and then I've glazed. So maybe what we'll do, we'll come back and revisit that and we'll do yeah. a canvas yeah. in, a, in another another show. Yeah, I'd like um, that. This, this is lovely. And because you're getting the four stamps, um, it does mean you could have four of these. Um, and they would look absolutely fantastic. They really would. Uh, birds of a feather, uh, three-way overlay stamps for you. And you've also got the stencils as well. So birds of a feather flock together. Fly where your dreams take you. You've got it's time to spread your wings and fly and try out your wings absolutely beautiful and remember you've got all those different ways of using the stamps if you want to get your one day special it's proving to be busy uh, two payments if you want to we can divide the cost over two months it's 804 756 is your item number now the groovy plates are busy the groovy plates we've got for you on the show with the same theme over a third of the stock has already gone. Uh, £16.96, it's a fabulous price, saving £3, and you're getting the four plates. And on the front of the plates, um, you'll see a little code. I'll ask Maria about that in a moment. Um, you've got a freedom price on there as well, and that freedom price is £15.26. I think I've got that right. It's, it's on the front. Is that to do the little box and the code underneath? Is that to do with tutorials? It's free storage. That's it. Free storage. So that we've got binders that you can store your, your groovy plates in. So if you carefully take the uh, the little sticker That's off it. the groovy plate and pop it on the pocket yep. where that plate is going to live, and then you know exactly if if there's an empty one, you know what should be there. You know what you're missing. There you <laughs> go. There is method to my madness, and of course, what a great solution for you so that's why you've got that love that okay. right what we're gonna have a look at next okay so um, we're gonna do um, we're gonna use a little bit of alcohol ink and we're gonna do a sort of a two for you one had me at product oh okay I'm only kidding <laughs> drink responsibly indeed um, so this is where I wanted to go if I give this to Ooh, you yes oh, okay give this to me as in I can keep it maybe you maybe heard tomorrow. it here live on no, I'm only kidding <laughs> maybe um, tomorrow this is lovely uh, and this is put into one of the coaster yeah uh, do we have those on the show I wonder we can have you can have a look on the website for those um, I think they're fabulous and it means your artwork then becomes a great gift love that yeah so it's uh, that's on, on acetate as well so that the coast is actually translucent wow which I thought that'd be a little, yeah. bit, little bit different superb okay. but then also in the process of creating that yeah we can actually Ah. create this as well at the same time at the same time yeah. so yeah. we can get a coaster a two for one a two for we like those yeah superb superb let's have a look then okie doke right so this is where i was saying number two stamp is yes. is my is my favorite okay um just personally try out your wings so try out your wings all right so let's have a little look let me get my bits and bobs together that i'm going to use um so to be sure that um i'm going to be able to use um, do the other piece. I need to make sure I've got a piece of card ready, okay, yep. with my stamp on. So I've got number two on my piece of acetate mounted up, okay, and then I've got a piece of acetate here to um, to work on. So let's just, we've got a few bits. There we go. Not that it matters. There we go. 
all right so i'm going to stamp on here now when you stamp on acetate it does take a while to dry but yep. one of the um things that um people believe is that archival won't dry on acetate um mm. it actually will it just takes some time okay but it but it will dry right so let me just put that up there so i can put this on a nice flat surface so i'm going to ink this up so this is number two stamp and this is try out your wings i'm just going to get plenty of ink onto here they're okay. like tropical birds aren't they they, well, the they can is, be whatever you like actually, yeah flowers and flowers birds and butterflies to me they can be anything you want depending on the colors that you 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 make them yeah okay true. so i'm just going to pop that onto the acetate and again give that a press i've got one that's already dry anyway so i don't need to worry about this one too much there we go let's have a little peek okay yeah i think we're okay I'm going to go for it. As I say, I've got one that can jump to anyway, so I'm not too worried. I'm just going to peel that away. Oh, okay. Wow, look at that. Right. That's so clean and yeah. crisp, isn't it's, it? It's quite nice. Yeah, I like that. So I'm just going to pop that to one side for, for the moment okay. because that needs to, normally it would need to dry. I've got one that I can go to. Okay. But while we're waiting, okay, um, what we'll do is we'll prepare the other piece that we're okay. going to use. So I've got the um, petite designer card so oh, this is love um, northern lights so this is the one i put ready to the top the one that i'm going to use um like so so this is nice the difference between this and the paper pads yes. there's a size this is five by seven uh, this is single side so you don't have to choose okay but also it's the it's thicker yeah. okay so depending on what you're doing um you might want We've got uh, the details for those on the screen right now. So pick a mix of any two uh, with a free A5 folder worth six ninety eight. dollars um, So it's a great way of picking and choosing, but also having that folder as well. We've got Shenandoah, we've got Rainbow River, we've got Indian Summer, and we've also got the Northern Nights for you. Oh, we've got, oh, Waimea Falls. Do you know what? I was looking at some pictures of the Waimea Falls. I used to live near there, actually. It's something that Barbara and I have got in common. We both know that place very well. Uh, and there's your Toscana. Uh, superb. Oh, they, they were all to do with um, Hawaii Waimea Falls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I've just put a little bit of talc on oh, here. Oh, you Okay, because I'm going to heat in bars, and what I don't want is my powder stick into areas un unwanted. So I'm yeah. using anti-static bag. I'll give it a brush with talc, and that'll do the job. So I've got my embossing powder open ready, okay, because the sooner, once we stamp, the sooner we get the powder on, the better, the, the, the less ch uh, time the ink's got to dry. Got you. Okay. See all these tips it's great isn't it yeah sometimes it's just small things that make a difference to um to your project so let me just pop that to one side so again i'm going to come in now on this one um i'm going to use my versafine the reason i didn't use this one on my acetate is because versafine is actually oil based so it would take an age to dry on, on yeah. the acetate so but on here it's going to be absolutely fine and it's going to stay juicy for me to get that powder on okay okay so so I'm never far away from both my Versafine and my archival. They're yes. both very, very um, handy. Okay, so I'm going to stamp that. doesn't matter where because I'm going to trim it down anyway. So again, straight down and give it a nice press. Here we go. And I've got my clear powder ready. Okay. Make sure you press all over your image, whether yep. you're using your platform, your mounts or, or acetate. Yeah. Okay. So hopefully that'll be fine. There you go. That's lovely, isn't it? Isn't that really nice? Oh, wow. Um, and then I'm going to get the powder over. Now, if you too um, like this one, like Marie, and this is your favourite, you want to buy it um, on its own out of the One Day Special, you're more than welcome to do so. We do have the sets available for you. They're $19.99, but of course the best value is in that One Day Special. But if you did want to buy them separately, they're available at $9.99. Also the stencils, sorry, $19.99. The stencils are available separately as well if you want to go for those. We've got a special price on those, £14.92, just okay. for the One Day Special. Right, so I'm going to embark. Yeah. yeah. Just going to heat my heat gun up first of all. Okay, give it a minute, and then on we go. So now when I come on to heat in box, I'm quite close, and I'm going to keep it in, now can you see it start to turn? So yeah. as soon as that turns, I move my gun on. All right, and I do it in a... Um, oh wow, look at that. Yeah, so just move on, and move on, 
keep the gum moving as the powder turns. Okay. And then down to there. Right, and then a little that. waft. It's, there's no good just, you know, giving it a waft like that because all that's doing is drying. It's not mm. going to emboss it. Also, if you stay there for too long, what happens is your powder all melts away and it'll disappear. Okay. So as soon as it turns, move the gun on. Just keep your gun moving. All right. That's Beautiful. Isn't it nice? Yeah. It, oh, do you know what? It almost looks like that's been die cut out. It does doesn't actually, it? doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, it does. It really does. Yeah. It's beautiful. Okay, so what we've got now, we've got a couple of pieces, and I'm going to leave put that acetate over somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't, because I say that will need time um, to dry, but this one is already dry. Okay. Um, so I've got my two pieces ready. I'm going to put my stamps over to one side because I'm going to bring in another couple of bits and bobs now so i need uh, alcohol inks okay <laughs> every time you say that i do, do you need <laughs> i need alcohol <laughs> again drink responsibly indeed right okay so oh, no, me. no i didn't mean that <laughs> have a little look i'm also going to need um, a blending tool so i'm going to reach into my pergamano bag and i'm going to grab uh, my blending pen yes and i'm also going to grab from the depths of the bag a couple of oh the blending nibs. let's see that let's christen a couple of new ones um for, for tv we do have the blending pens and nibs for you on the show mm. we'll bring the details on the screen as you see these and you think oh they look fantastic you can put them into your basket 12 pounds and 43 pence you get a blending pen kit you get one tool and you get 23 nibs and tweezers so you can pop them in and you can pop them out indeed okay right so first job here now is we're going to put some alcohol ink um, onto here to color it but an important thing here is this is the side that i've stamped the image on um, now the alcohol and then the permanent ink if yes. i put the, the the ink on this side yep. this would just blend and, and it would bleed and i would lose my my image right. so very important you need to turn that over and we're going to put the alcohol ink on the back got you all right got you so let's um go with a couple of um colors let's have a little dig through um those are quite nice right so what i'm going to do is just pop oh a few drops onto the piece okay that's nice that's a nice color what's that uh stream there we go and some down on them i think we'll get a bit yellow in here as well yeah so I'm just going to pop it on uh, this one is stone washed it's a nice shade and as I say let's just to kind of brighten it up a little bit we've got some sunshine yellow there we go I think that is plenty on there okay so ink is on there so I'm going to come in now with um, blending uh, tool and a yep. piece of felt so I'm gonna um, I'll just go with that one actually that'll be fine save changing it and I'm just gonna pop just one little drop of the alcohol blending solution onto here I don't want too much because I don't want to soak this yeah and I'm just going to just pounce that up and down oh like so if I put too much of the alcohol um, solution on then it, I kind of just bleach this out a little bit which is not what I want to achieve right here we go all right so that's got nice plenty of color on there all right like that okie dokie so what we're going to do with that now is let's move on to a clean piece all right and that'll just take a minute to dry but what i'm going to do just at home i let this dry completely on its own i don't mess with it okay. I just let it do its thing as it only takes a couple of minutes but in tv time it's, yeah. <laughs> it's quite busy yeah so i'm going to give it just a tiny tiny blast because for one thing i don't want to melt the acetate yes and also i don't want to uh, sort of heat the i'm ink. just thinking i've got an idea Go could you put that on to shrink plastic and then shrink it up and have it like some earrings uh, yes you could oh, yeah oh wow yeah but make sure the alcohol ink is is dry on there yes. before you shrink it yeah but yeah you're absolutely good actually shrink plastic was one of my ideas really? i had a big long list when i was sort of planning and yeah. before i start prepping demos i have a plan all the things yes. that i think would, would loan themselves yeah. with the, the stamps and stencils and that was on there there you well. go you so, see great minds yeah. birds of a feather Th flock there together. you go <laughs> right there you so i'm just going to give it just literally a tiny little waft yeah. okay we don't want to we don't want to kill it all right i'm going to leave it like that 
okay and we'll see what happens so i'll have a little look and see i can always put it down and give it a blot and see it hasn't got to be absolutely yeah there, there you go that. that's good enough right so what i need to do now because if you look at the finished coaster you'll see that my my birds are very much a different colour yeah, they are. Um, to the, the background and also the colour is very much contained within that black outline. Let me pop that on there, just there you go. Okay. Love that. Yeah? Right. Yeah, I do like that and I actually thought um, that I'm going to make a set of those for home as well because I've got very boring um, coasters. So I, thought I, really, I do really, really like those. So Especially in the summer time, as well. Mm -hmm yeah nice for gifts as well i like making things that are gifts yeah. as well as just cards love that right okay so i think we're good to go let me pop those to one side and um, that box isn't in the way is it we all right I'll, I'll move it anyway okay and then it's gone sorry i'm just pushing okay. yeah go for it where everyone do, at home where can where notice and you turned yeah. your back and i'll like, uh, uh, we'll just get that lined up go. for the overhead do, camera that's that okay? what i was doing yeah right that's there? perfect okay all right i'm always happy to be told because yeah. i i move things around and, and i get a bit carried away okay so what i'm going to do now in effect i'm going to take color out of the birds and yep. out from the the outside and i'm going to use that ink what you would do is get rid of the ink on yeah, here yeah, you but would. why do that when if just by being forward thinking we've got another ah. image here and we can use that color to color this image so that's basically what we're going to do like you so thinking. i'm just going to pop just a couple of drops of the the blending solution because we kind of need to wet this back up yep. but not soak it so i'm just literally going to dip that um the tool the nib into the solution it's not soaked okay, okay. don't soak it there's no need and then i'm going to come in and just if you soak it too much what will happen is the solution will wick out of your of your bed and it will start to um, affect blend um, yeah. with the outside we don't want that we literally just want nice and neat to take the color out of the bed so you can see how the colors coming oh. out from there so i'm going to take that color and i'm going to come into my other image and i'm going to pop it in there That's okay. okay like so so I'm going to come back in, mm -hmm. and up his tail, like so, and take the colour away. So see now it's, it doesn't want to take any more because I've kind of loaded the nib. Yeah. So I'll come in and trans... So we're transferring the colour yeah, now onto the... the colour now onto, onto here instead, okay? So let's get a bit of that yellow taken out from here as well. There we go, that'd be nice. And also plant that from here also make sure you get really nice kind of contamination but it's blends oh. that you would if you tried to get those sort of blends you, by colour you'd, you'd never get them so it's kind of happy accidents if you like yes there we go so now what's happening you can see there's nothing i'm not picking up any ink so i'm going to come and give it a tiny little tap back into the blending solution and then we can uh, move again okay lifts it, doesn't but it? literally the tiniest drop because we don't want it to to wick out of the birds so again we can come in over here and the brighter the color see i've i've stuck to um blues and greens on here but if i had you know pinks and, and, and greens and all sorts on here then my piece here would yeah. be a lot brighter but it's a it's a muted look that i want on this one there we go so you can see just in that wing can you yeah. see it's kind of blended already isn't it yeah. dark to light it's very good go. so again as soon as you're not removing any more color because all of that will come off you can see from that bed can't you that you know it, that all of that ink is coming out yeah so just keep going until you're happy let's put a bit more there but into his tail here all right so we've got one bird there <coughs> yes. okay how are we doing for, for time, time we? wise oh we've got about 18 minutes left on the show have we can, yeah. can i do another take another of course you can yes yeah. right? okay just because then we've got two to color haven't we so let's come down to this one he's quite he's quite chunky this one he's uh, he's worked quite well fed there we go so he's gonna color there you go plenty of color on here so again, just come back and remove the colour and transfer it down. And again, see there, look at that blend. So we're not going to add any more colour to that one. I'm going to leave it as is. So what a great technique to use because you're not wasting anything, are you? I, I love anything where you get two things and you can use up sort of your waste. I, I love that sort of technique. And remember everyone, this is a stamp. It looks, if you have just joined us, it might look 
like this has been die cut out but it's yeah. not it's a stamp it it's is. part of a three-way overlay set mm -hmm. Uh, this is just one part of that stamp set. You can use them together to fill all, all of the colours in or you can use them separately. Uh, and then we've used some embossing powder on there. It looks absolutely remarkable. Yeah, right. So let's imagine we've taken the colour out of out of all the beds. So now what we want to do is put some colour in. Yes. All right, so um, I've gone with sort of yellowy and red. So here I've got like my, uh, I have a palette for my alcohol inks. Yep. So all I'm going to do, let me just reach... And my alcohol oh. normally comes on a palette. No, I'm only kidding. Sorry. <laughs> Got to stop saying things in your head, Janice. You need a night out, don't you? I think you need a night Are you out. Off? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we need something. So we can go out. <laughs> can we go out after the show? <laughs> Shall we? Out, out in Arundel. Oh, yeah. I think everyone would be sure. I was going to say, it's, yeah, it's a bit quiet around there, isn't it? We can change but that. Are, then, they, are they ready for us? No. There we go. So I'm just going to put a couple of drops in my palette. Okay. We get a little bit of yellow as well. There we go. And then put in there just a couple of drops. The alcohol inks, they go such a long way. Yeah. And there are so many techniques that you can do. So I've got a fresh um, uh, nib in here. So I'm going to take move that one out the way because that is we're kind of done with that but we're filling just with the waste yeah. on, on that although we could come in at the same time and put some more if we wanted okay. so i'm going to come in with that lovely red so i'm going to pick up just a little bit and i'm going to come in and i'm now just going to add the color in there we go Nice and subtle, and but so effective. Yeah, effect. very much so. Do you know what? It reminds me like a stained glass window. That's exactly what I yeah. uh, what I was hoping for. And you could put that, we're going to put that in a coaster, but you could put that in a card, could yeah, you? Yeah, you certainly could. Why not? Yeah. Um, let's see. So let's get some red down in this chap as well. And remember, I'm working on the back. The stamped image yes. is, on, is on the front. Here we go. Some down there, and then if you want to get some yellow in there and give it a bit of a blend, mm -hmm. lighter colour. So I'm going to go with a, a new nib, pop that on. There we go. The yellow, really, the yellow. Couple of coats of the yellow. Let it dry and then come back in. Yeah. Put another one. Having said that, it looks a little bit luminous. That isn't it? Is that the right word? Luminous. Um. Yeah. I've been very good with words today, haven't I? Oh, so you've been very good with words. <laughs> There you go, a bit more in his head, a bit more. So you can just see, you can get the colours coming yeah. with another layer, it brightens that up, okay? And then we let that dry, simple as that. Uh, the outside bit, I can either come in with the tool and remove it with the pen, but to be honest, because it's a bigger area, I take a piece of tissue with a little bit of blending solution yeah. and just wipe it up and then ah. it's done very quickly. Yeah. And then that's where we will end up with the nice, yeah. with the neat one. Should we move that? There you yeah. go. How's that? Love that. Shall I give that back to you? Yeah. <laughs> I wish, right. yeah. Nice um, and easy. It's fantastic, isn't it? What a great gift. And what a wonderful way of using that ink uh, twice over. Yeah. And this is the other sample that we're working on right there. Yeah. Uh, so again. I'll finish that one. Yep. Um, at some point. Perfect. Uh, your one day special, 804756. If you want to go for your one day special, two paints of £39.94. You're getting 12 stamps and the four stencils as well. You're saving £15, so you're getting the stencils for free. We're doing the stencils. If you want to buy them separately, you can. We've got a special discounted price of £14.92. Um, and that price will only stay at that discounted price, I believe, for the one day special hours. After that, those stencils will go back up to £19.92. Uh, right. So whilst you check out your baskets, we're going to have a look at this.
Right, this is your one day special. We launch a one day special here on Hochanda, six o'clock every single day. And it's a, a one day special, it's supposed to last 24 hours. Remember, we have a live show now, another live show at nine o'clock tonight, and then we have 9 a.m. and one o'clock and five o'clock tomorrow, but we have those repeats overnight as well. So you can always watch this show again if you wish. So your one day special, let's take a look at what you're getting. Four sets of three stamps, and these are your overlay stamps. You can use them separately if you want to, but the idea is to start building up that picture. You've got your outline there. You could use it just like that. You could add some Zentangle in there if you wish, or just have that really simplistic black and white image. We then put the inlay to those words and to the actual birds themselves. And then you want the background colored in, or maybe you just want to use that one on its own. So the background is colored in, you get that lovely monochrome effect. The choice, of course, as always, is yours. You've got lots of different uh, ways of using these. You've got those beautiful sayings in there as well. It's time to spread your wings and fly you've got birds of a feather flock together which is lovely they certainly do uh, fly where your dreams take you and try out your wings you're also getting the full stencils as well included in the deal and you can buy elements of this deal individually as well just to show you some samples actually using with those stencils uh, this deal is a great deal because you're getting the stencils really uh, for free because you're saving 15 pounds or at a special discounted price for this hour 39 pounds and 94 pence is your first payment of two if you wish to pay over flexi buy it means it's interest free payments and it makes it affordable makes it affordable so a lovely way of using your stamps to build and create some wonderful cards and remember you can use all three stamps together to build the picture or you can use them separately to start making different designs that's your one day special from Clarity Stamps, but what we do have for you are some groovy plates. Yes, we have. Uh, oh, 40% of the stock of the groovy plates have already gone and they work hand in hand with your one day special. Um, I love groovy. Uh, this gives you a chance to use your parchment papers and to start building and creating some lovely designs. You can mix and match as well. That's the beauty of groovy like that made a, made a rhyme there that's the beauty of groovy there's a freedom price on here as well 15 pounds and 26 pence which means you're making a saving as a freedom member a greater saving look at that that's astonishing isn't it with that pico cutting around the edge beautiful beautiful uh, imagery here's something completely different take a look at that on your parchment again the birds are singing and with the groovy plates of course you can put the birds on repeat as well um, so you can have more than the birds on the actual imagery i'm just going to show you another couple of samples as well which look beautiful look at that isn't that gorgeous with the lovely blues and the greens in there and now we've got a lovely design here with the pico edging so you wait till you get these home and start adding your color if you want to uh, very busy for these though 16 pounds and 96 pence but freedom members you do get your discount nine seven five eight nine seven i don't know why i, st I don't know why i stopped there uh eight nine seven that's your groovy those are your groovy plates you're getting four of them uh we've also got the trio of birds as well the die collection uh these are your fresh cut dies also from clarity and this is five five two one eight one 34 pounds and 97 pence you're saving 10 pounds on that deal um, and those are your aperture dies plenty of snippability in there as well after you've put them into your apertures if you want to cut anything out We've also got the stencils as well. And this is the trio of birds. So the same designs, but in stencils. These are 9.97. You are buying three, but you're only paying for two with that price. Superb. 740759. Seven by seven inches in size. Okay. Which is probably the size of both you and I on people's screens. <laughs> Okay. I wonder. Depends Measure us and let us know. <laughs> it does. It does. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, what are we going to have Some a look groovy? at now? Right. Let's so do we're going to aim towards this one here. If I give Ooh, that. Oh yeah. Let's have a look at you. this. Isn't that lovely? Okay. I love the font that's been used in these. Yeah, I really it's do. Quite cool, isn't it? And in, into join together. Yeah. Try out your wings. Uh huh. Beautiful. Okay. 
And I guess the beauty of Groovy is that if you didn't want to use try out your wings, you don't have to put that there. No. Nope. If you just wanted try out your wings, but you didn't want the birds, you could do that as well. Very much so. Yeah. Just pull out the elements that suit you yep. and use them in, in whatever composition that, that you like. So for here, for example, that's actually in a circle, whereas on the plates, um, yeah, they're square. It, yeah, of course it is. Okay. Perfect. Lovely. Right. All right. Okie doke. So first job Ooh. then. Oh, you're okay. Nearly so I'm going to pop flew. that. So <laughs> all right. Um, so I need to do just a little bit of die cutting. So I've got okay. my fold up there. If I just put that here. Yep. So I've got my Pico, nested Pico Ooh, square dies. Yes, nested Pico okay. square dies. Um, so I'm going to cut from translucent parchment, first of all. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm just going to pop that through the machine for a second die cut now the pico nesting die sets i'm sure we've got these on our website yeah. um, they're absolutely fantastic because it gives you that pico edge that professional pico edge without you cutting the individual absolutely, parts absolutely yeah. yeah but then also you've got the option they are available individually um, but we've also got the uh, groovy plate that coordinates as well, which is, I'm going to show you how to use that now. This, by the way, is Maria's folder. So if you're thinking, yeah. oh, it's not going to look very nice if I buy that as a gift for somebody. It's because these are Maria's these are, these are and mine. she keeps hers in the folder, keeps them all nice yeah. and organised. Yeah. Okay, rightio. So um, what I've done, I've gone ahead and I've already cut a larger one. So if I show you here, so I've got two sizes. So I've got my green background piece um, and I've got my artwork piece here as well. So I'm going to switch on my uh, my light wave now. Okay, so here we go. All right. Ooh. Yeah, so that's nice and bright. It's not essential, but it's desirable and it's particularly useful when you're using dark coloured parchment. Yes. So you can see through the, the, the parchment. Um, so I'm using, uh, we've got a pack on the website. I think it's, yes. uh, tw it's either 20 or 26 sheets and it's multi coloured pack, but there's lots of different. Um, there are some packs just with one colour in. And we've got the, gr we've got, right, we've got the groovy yeah. plate underneath. Yes, um, exactly. So this Look groovy how plate, easy you can see that. Yeah, it's fab. So this groovy plate yeah. coordinates with the dies. The die, right. So I've cut and I've got the lovely pico edge. But now what I can do is, um, you can see I've lined it up against the little markers, which are the the picos. Yep. So that I can now put this lovely, very neat frame in place as well. All right. So I'm going to give it a rub with a tumble dryer sheet. And if you don't have a tumble okay. dryer sheet, what could you uh, use? You can use the bottom of like a, a tea light candle, but very gently. You're not trying to smear wax on there. You just mm. want a little bit of slick, a little bit of anti-slide yeah. um, so that your tool glides. All right. And then I'm going to use my groovy guard, which is in the accessory pack. I'm going to press my, um, my parchment down with this. And I'm going to come in with uh, my one millimetre Pergamon oh, wow, tool. Yeah, really, really Isn't crisp. Isn't that great? Look at that, very two crisp. lines, perfect. Yeah. Okay, and then I'm going to flip it round uh, this way and do the same. So if you're using the starter kit, then you would use tool number one for this. Okay. Right, now my, my two other sides have got a groovy tab over holding those down. Yeah. So before I move one of these so I can emboss this side, I'm going to put another groovy tab over here where I've already yeah. done before. So that way it's not going to move, okay? And then I can pop that one down here. So nice and easy, so it's still all lined up. Makes sense. Um, the side that I'm working on, on the coloured parchment, the side that's facing me is the darker side. Right. Okay. Um, if you use the other side, then what you'll find is you'll have the brighter parchment to the front of your work, but your white will be more muted. Okay. Got it's you. not wrong. Yeah. Um, it's just if you want the bright white, more then work, work from um, the darker side. Now we've got four minutes left on this show. Wow. Please don't hurry, Maria, because we've got another show at <laughs> nine o'clock today. Today. I don't know where the time goes, it, it flies, just really, really it? flies it by. Flies. Okay, well, what we could do on here um, is, what we, <laughs> I've got different elements that Go I could do. I was going to say I could show the, the, the mat, how to make the, the layer where I'm going to sit this into. You could do Can whatever do you that? like. And then we'll continue and do the main artwork at, at nine o'clock. Yeah. Should we do that? Okay, cool. So what I've done here then, um, to make the mount, is I've now turned the parchment okay so this is what I mean it's like a photo corner yeah. mount if you like and then it's also practicing your pico cutting as well yeah yeah 
So if you wanted to, you could actually just take that out if it wasn't connected to the brass. Exactly, yeah. yeah, and replace the artwork. Superb. Okay, so a good idea with this um, is to actually, you can, if you've got a ruler, you can measure up and do a little, so let's say, for example, three centimetres. So if I put a little mark at three centimetres and three centimetres, I'm going to be absolutely spot on. Yes. I tend to wing it, to be honest. I tend to eyeball it and think, well, that looks about, but if you want precision, do measure it okay so wing now, it i like wing, that yeah, I, I you do. see you've yeah. got your, your birds of a feather winging it together yeah here we go all right so now i've put that corner in place and i would do that in all four corners okay and then quite simply i'm going to turn the light panel off yep okay so there we go all right so Ooh. now you can see isn't that nice and yeah. bright and, and white it's, Let me it's just show you good that. isn't it look at that how crisp and clean is that and precise there you go yeah that is the results of course okay the gives you right here so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to come across and do some hair freighting Sorry. along there that's okay so um this is the bit that's going to be seen this is going to your work is going to be behind here okay so let me use my groovy guard again and all i'm going to do here i'm going to come in with my two needle hair freighting tool yep and I'm just going to come along and pair freight. So my tool is nice and upright when it actually goes into the parchment. And I'm putting one needle back in the previous hole. There's something so that looks so satisfying about that. It must be very mindfulness using you. It is. Once you've sort of, you know, it's a traditional um, parchment technique. And once you've got your head around it, once you practice and you realise, actually, I've cracked it, I know how to do it, it does become um, very satisfying when you see you, you can achieve a really nice result. Do you know, I'd like to do a time lapse of that. There we go. That yeah. would look good. <laughs> All right. So I've perforated along. And then what we would do, what have we got left? About one a minute and a half. About a minute and a half. Well, yes. Yeah, Again, okay. don't rush. Please don't <laughs> cool. rush. About, just, about a minute now. Just do a couple of snips. Shall I? About 55 seconds about now. 55 no, I'm only kidding. <laughs> okay. So this is important. Bit. So this is the bit that's going to be seen. All right. Yep. So that's the bit that I want the neat edge to be. So I'm going to come underneath and I'm going to put my scissors in. Tiny, tiny um, bit. Okay. So in, down, twist and snip. It, whoop, next one, in, down, twist and snip, in, down, twist and snip. And you literally just work your way along. And as you work your way along, you think, well, that doesn't look very neat. It will do when you get to the end. Yeah. Have faith. In, down, twist and snip. Well, we've got about 30 seconds left yeah. on this show. Do check out your baskets, but we you can join Maria again at 9 o'clock yeah, tonight. That, and we, we can carry on yeah. with the demonstrations. Maria is back with Catherine at okay. nine o'clock tonight and then of course back tomorrow at 9 a.m. 1 p.m. Yeah, and 5 p.m. Yeah. final yeah. call we'll and lots, possibly good morning for Chanda we'll see uh, but it's been great to have your company great to work with you again Marie mm -hmm. you know I love working with you uh, please stay where you are because we've got another fabulous show coming up with our apps <laughs>